जीन थेरेपी टू क्यो कैंसर इज ए मेडिकल ब्रेक थ्रू इन इंडिया According to the latest estimates by the World Health Organization, India has the highest cancer burden in the world with over 14.13 lakh new cancer cases and 9.16 lakh deaths in 2022. But amid the growing panic, there seems to be a glimmer of hope. Once the newest most promising treatments for blood cancer is chimeric antigen receptor CAR T cell therapy. These therapies use your body's own immune system to help fight cancer. Pain medicine or University of Pennsylvania Health System and the Perelman School of Medicine was a pioneer in the initial discovery of the first CAR T cell medications. What is CAR T cell therapy? CAR T cell therapy is a type of cancer immunotherapy treatment that uses immune cells called T cells that are genetically altered in a lab to enable them in locating and destroying cancer cells more effectively. Healthy T cells or natural killer NK cells are removed from the patients via apheresis. In apheresis, a centrifuge machine draws blood from your body and spins the blood to separate its components like plasma, platelet rich plasma, leukocyte, and erythrocyte. The machine sets aside certain components and returns the remaining blood cells, platelets, plasma to your body. Once healthy cells are in the lab, they are multiplied. The genes are special receptor known as chimeric antigen receptor CAR is then introduced to the surface of the T cells. This allows them to easily target the cancerous cells once infused into the patient. This large volume of engineered cytotoxic cells is reinfused into the patient where the cells are able to mount a supersized attack on their target. This receptor binds specifically for a protein called CD19, which is often overproduced on the surface of leukemia and lymphoma cells. The most common side effects of CAR T therapy include neurologic toxicities and cytokine release syndrome (CRS). But what diseases are treated with CAR T cell therapy? CAR T treatment can be very effective against some types of cancer, even when other treatments are not working. This treatment is applicable to those patients who have relapsed two or more times. This individualized treatment teaches the patients very own T cells and how to find and kill cancerous cells in the body. Currently, CAR T therapy is FDA approved to treat several types of hematological malignancies including leukemia, lymphoma, multiple myeloma. The indigenous CAR T cell therapy which reprogrammed a patient's immune system to fight cancer was recently approved for commercial use by the Central Drug Standard Control Organization, CDSCO, India. In India, this first indigenously developed CAR T cell therapy for cancer treatment was launched in April 2024. This gene-based therapy developed by the Indian Institute of Technology, IIT Bombay and Tata Memorial Center is being rolled out in India at about one-tenth of its price outside the country. The next CAR-19 CAR T cell therapy is the country's first made in India CAR T cell therapy, which is expected to bring down the cost of treatment significantly. What is next CAR-19? In a promising development in the area of cancer treatment, next CAR-19, India's first indigenously developed CAR T cell therapy, is now available for commercial use. It can be given to cancer patients, especially those who are suffering from blood cancer, including leukemia and lymphomas. The next CAR-19 CAR T cell therapy was first used on a 64-year-old Delhi-based doctor who paid Rs. 43 lakhs to access the treatment, which approximately cost Rs. 3 to 4 crores abroad. Dr. V. K. Gupta is now totally cancer-free. IIT Bombay director said that 
Next car 19 needs to be custom manufactured for every patient under the most stringent conditions, but it has been ruled out at approximately one tenth of the price at which it is available outside India. He also says that the treatment costs approximately rupees four crore abroad against rupees thirty lakh in India. So the low cost CAR T cell therapy is a huge achievement for the country and for cancer patients and places India firmly on the global map of cell and gene therapy. This treatment will provide a new light of hope for the welfare of mankind in the fight against this cancer disease.